Alright guys, it's showtime. Match 27 in the FT Arena SCC AI Tournament. <clears throat> this will be between Gatebuster202 and Rex. <clears throat> so, the team of four Geomancers, we got Alexi, Leslie, Roxanne, and Celeste. And for Rex, sporting a team of Squires, Mira, Toa, D Delphi, and Minerva. So, which will who's gonna win between the two of them? Uh, it's hard to say. Rex does have a slight speed advantage, and these two girls do have certainly of counter magic, which would work well against um, some um, at least half of um, of um, Gay Buster's team. But of course. If this one triggers either one one of these two for holy encounter magic, then the holy's gonna heal her thanks to the chameleon robe. And the squire does have charm, which he has three perfect targets for him to choose from. Um, this one has best compat with the squire right here, Virgo and Pisces. These two have bad compat, and this one and this one is just neutral compat. So, yeah, Rex has plenty of opportunities to overwhelm Gatebuster. Uh, but Gatebuster does have a few tricks up its sleeve as well. Like this one right here has Secret Fist. It won't affect uh, this Squire, but it can affect these three. So Rex better be on the lookout for Geomancy procs, if not uh, death, sen death Sentence. There we go. And of course, Drow Geos, we all know, are very, very strong. Very strong. And Rex does have some okayish mag Magic Evade. But it might not be enough to survive the onslaught of the draw of Geomancer, unless they can work together. That's what the Squire seems to be relying on right now. But enough talk, let's get to the fight. We're going to be going to map 59, Underground Book Storage, 3rd floor. Good luck to the both of you. May the best class win. Honestly, I'm a fan of both Geomancers and Squires. They're just so well versed in what and how they can function. Very well versed. So who are you guys rooting for? Are you rooting, are you rooting for Rex? Are you rooting for Gatebuster? Or are you just rooting for some good competition? Masamune from the start. Now Rex does not have Draw, but he does have Haste 2. But then again, Gatebuster... Geomancer also has Haste 2. As she demonstrates here. Everyone still just getting in range. Now we're going to see a, a raise 2 coming up. Questions will that hit? Earth Slash. Uh, hits one, but heals the other. Slow 2 looks like is on... Um, looks, like, looks like it's coming up here. Toa's going to go for a Slash. One hit KO on the Martial Arts Geomancer. Demi hitting two people. Counter Magic. And more Counter Magic. Rex is using counter magic to his advantage so far. Raise 2 hits the undead squire. Kamatachi. No, don't act proc. Double counter magic. So again, Rex is using counter magic to his advantage, but will it be enough? That's the question. The stop's coming up. Uh, Minerva better cancel one of the spells. She will go for the sinkhole. The Delphi will rush forward to go for summon magic. Sinkhole, nice. Canceling that spell. Alexi gets up from re-raise, chakras himself, and runs off. Holy hits, um... One of the squires. Two got blocked, and one got killed from Titan. So Gatebuster is in command at the moment right now. See, Leslie would go for a card model. No, don't move proc. There's counter magic right there. Toa better go for Seldon Cross. Drops the two Geo Girls. So Rex is attempting to make a comeback here. Unless Gatebuster, got, unless Gatebuster has something to say about it. Celeste will rush back. Probably go for the race too. 89%. The Delphi will rush back to go for Leviathan. But Leslie can probably just heal herself. Or no, she's gonna go for the card model instead. Dropping the summon magic squire. There's a raise too. 
Naruto one hit KO right there. Wave Fist, 135 damage. He's not yet in critical. But, oh, Mira gets right back up. What's he gonna do? He's gonna go for the charm? Hits it. That might be the comeback that Rex needs here. We'll see, though. Toa gets up from re-raise and goes for a re-raise re himself. Let's see what can Alexi do. Alexi's gonna go for Earth Slash. Now, if he was smart... You see, there's a wish right there. I don't know, so he's gonna go for the Holy. Oh, but I got guarded. The kind of magic heal, which does not break the charm, mind you. Let's get a Genji shield on, believe. So, yeah, very lucky to block that holy. Oh, swing the miss. Too bad. And Earth Slash. Double kill. So, Gatebuster takes round one. We're going to be heading off to round two. All right, round two is about to begin right now as we are in map 86, Dogolia Pass. Rex's team is definitely on notice here that if he wants to be in contention for the championship match, he has to win this round and the next one. For Gatebuster, he's up one match to none, so if he drops this one, they're just both even. See how Ivy, no counter magic that time. Look a Quake. Ooh, counter magic, no petrify proc on either side. Now, unlike um, Rex's Squire, um, Gatebuster's Geomancer will get back up at least once because of re-raise. DS Knight, that Squire is just hanging on by a thread. Counter magic, but unfortunately misses the... Misses his time magic Squire, and a double kill off of... Uh, off a of Titan right there. So we're now we're at a two-on-two -two situation here. Oh, we, we are going to see a fairy, though. Wow, we're going to see a race, too. I know, this is Rex's chance to kind of close in here. Toe the Squire is still up and running. No one-shot. That's because he doesn't have enough power yet. And a Haze 2 coming up. The Delphi will go for more summon magic. Good for snipe, good for anti-sandbag. Demi. Low hurt and heal action. But those raise twos are still gonna keep um Gatebuster in the game here. Especially if they hit. Heaven's Cloud, low hurt and heal action. See, Minerva, well, what is she going to do? She's going to look for, looks to be a Demi-2, maybe a stop. Demi-2. And a counter magic. I don't know, Gatebuster looks to be in a good position. Now, as Rex is beginning to turn the tide now, if Toa can just one-shot the white magic Geomancer, then I think Rex will be in prime position to win. Like right about here. Oh, Petrify proc, never mind. Gatebuster might have just stolen this match. That Petrify proc could, could spell disaster. We'll have to see though. Down goes. Wait. Oh, Mira gets right back up. Rex is right back into this thing. Earth Slash, but no reaction. At all. No counter either. That would have been pretty bad for Rex if counter were to go off and it backfire. There's a Demi though. And Mira gets right behind him and ties it up. We are going to a round three. Okay, it's round three time. And we are now in map 58. UBS second floor. Rex was able to take round two because the undead squad was able to get right back up and finish off the mail. Punch our Geomancer. And the AO and the Squires of the AoE taking care of the Geomancers as well. Ooh, don't act proc right off the bat. That can't be good for Rex here. And the don't act proc is refreshed just for the hell of it. 
Uh, Gabe Buster is definitely in the lead. A very early lead. Demi too, but I don't think that will matter. Kel goes down, but he does have re-raise, mind you. He can't get right back up. And he can always catch re-raise onto himself anyways, like so. Unless... Anti-sandbag. And I don't act proc. Wow, Gatebuster is definitely on the verge of victory already. Those don't act procs are really going to hurt Rex in, in the long run here. Demi drops one to Geo's, but... Uh, counter magic, and it's going to heal. Yeah, Rex is not in a very good spot right now. So, it looks like that Rex is going to be going down to the loser's bracket. And Gatebuster can just sit there at the top until someone challenges him. See, Delphi will go for a fairy, but again, I don't see Rex pulling a miracle here. Unless the Undead Squire can do something magical. Secret Fist misses. Undead Squire does get right back up, but not for a whole lot of hell. There is a wish, though. But... That, to get, that sandbag's gonna get cancelled almost immediately. Another Don't Act proc. Wow. That's three Don't Act procs for Gatebuster in this whole match. Things just do not look good for Rex at all. Wish misses as if it would as if it would really matter at this point. Can I imagine not even don't act Croc. The RNG is just loving Gate Buster right now. Absolutely loving him. The Delphi is still trying with the with those fairies, but. But, I don't think that Rex has got what it takes right now. Yep, stop proc. Secret Fist, and it's gonna be over. There's not much else to say at the moment right now. Except GG Rex. The Squire's definitely put on one hell of a show. But don't despair, because they still got one more shot at making it to the top. Gatebuster, you definitely played very well. And you shall await the winner of the loser's bracket coming up. Another fairy, but again, I don't think that will matter too much. No undead squire even getting right back up either. Either so, Kamatachi. Oh, uh, it looks like another don't act. Probably. That would have been insult to injury, but won't matter. A double kill, and yep, that's it. So, Gabe Buster, congratulations, you await the winner. Of the losers bracket rex you had a, you put up a very good fight but if you can win the losers bracket you got one more shot gg and good luck